hey everyone welcome back to my channel so today we will be discussing how to install github desktop on your ubuntu kali debian and various linux based operating versions now i will provide you the github link um in my description just copy from there and open your chrome and just paste the link now the first task is to f find your .deb extension file from here now since mine is amd version so i am gonna go with this github desktop linux amd64 linux 1 just click on it wait for a while I have already downloaded it. I'll just close it. Close this. Discard. Now open your terminal. But first search for your file. How will you search? It simply go in downloads. I'll just delete the duplicate. Just one second. All right, just click on it. Rename. Control A, Control C, copy whole uh, name with extension. Close this file. Now let's begin with our step. So primarily, you will begin with um, CD, CD tilde operator slash downloads now the reason behind is uh, sometimes the directory fails to catch where the file has been stored now ls so you can see where is the file so there is this file okay now first write sudo apt update Type in your password. Just wait for a few seconds and just write sudo dpackage dash i and control shift v. Press enter. Now wait for some seconds and next write sudo apt dash dash fix dash broken install so done now just close this and open your um, this search bar and just write github so you can see it has been downloaded successfully now let us sign in sign I'll just write my password just use your authenticator app it will ask for sign in again and again because I have closed the verification just wait for one five seconds all right let's continue open github desktop yeah it's me so as you can see it has already found it everything let's clone our repository let's go for gfg right 
clone so as you can see let us open open in visual studio code so these are my codes that were saved so yes so as you can see we have successfully downloaded github desktop on our linux based operating machine so i hope this video you found really helpful you don't have to worry about anything uh, the github repository will be shared in the description you can just simply click on it and copy paste in your web browser that's it so i hope this video founds you really helpful thank you for watching and make sure to like subscribe and share